Hello friends. Now we will discuss about electrophoresis. Actually, the colloidal particles have a very large surface area. So they absorb either positive charge or negative charge. That means the colloidal particles are charged. Now, when an electric field is applied to the colloidal mixture, the colloidal particles will move towards a particular electrode. And this movement of colloidal particles towards a particular electrode is called electrophoresis. I repeat, when an electric field is applied to a colloidal mixture, the colloidal particles move towards a particular electrode. This is called electrophoresis. Electrophoresis is classified in two categories. One is called cataphoresis another is called anaphoresis when the colloidal particles are positively charged then in presence of electric field, the colloidal particles move towards cathode and this is called cataphoresis. Cataphoresis is observed in case of ferric hydroxide sol because ferric hydroxide sol contain positive charge. Whereas the colloidal mixture where the colloidal particles contain negative charge, it moves towards anode. In case of blood, blood is a colloidal mixture which contains negative charge, anaphoresis takes place. That's all about electrophoresis. Thank you. For testing your understanding of this lesson and more videos, log on to www.tubelessons.net